Hello everyone, this is Lunar and welcome to more Benji and Kazooie. Last time we finished Click Clock Wood, the best world in the game. And this is a bonus episode where I will show every Brin Children around the world. So you can have your own Brin Childers and they can tell you secrets about Grunty. Because that is randomized through every single file. So you may get some answers like me, you may get some answers different than me, but let's see. Grunchies brush her rotten teeth with moldy cheese flavored toothpaste. Oh. Also washes her hair with baked beans. Yuk. And she gets her closet from the witch's warehouse. I love I love when the answer is actually the garbage. <laughs> this is a possible answer, and I simply love that that answer. It's just so funny. She picked her claws from the garbage. <laughs> anyway, uh, if they are not far from each other, I won't skip. But if they are, I will just do that. So I pretty sure know uh, where every single bring two days of the game. So. There's no problem with me finding them. And then again, this can serve as a test for, you know, the game doesn't freeze on the middle of the record. Anyway, there's a green tool over here. I believe Grunty's nickname was Jelly Belly, uh, which is cool. I also know that a freshly burst boils is a fa uh, favorite smell. And the old time favorite color is a dumb brown. Wow, Grunty. Wow. wow. You know, we're, we're learning more secrets about Grunty. So I'll be skipping now. I think the next one is gonna fall. So. so another one is closed by. Uh, uh, Clunker's Curlin. Crunchy wears a flea circus under that repulsive dress of hers. She also got this nasty pet dog whose name is Leg Chomper. Alright. My sister sing in her own band, Grunties and the Cauldron Crew. They are awful. Thank you, Brunchilda. Anyway, on to the next one. So behind the witch uh, thing, on the the fork between the Gobi's Valley and uh, Bubble Love Swamp, there's this bring to it. My little sister often sleeps on a pillow of treasure, the dirty hag. The only thing she ever won was the sweatiest socks competition at which school. Okay. Wait. Okay. I accidentally pressed B there. Right. She often boasts of appearing on the cover of Fat Hack Monthly, sitting on her broomstick. Oh boy. I mean, for a witch, I think that's something to boast about. I don't know. I, I would assume that a witch has a broom. But close by it, uh, in. No, not this one, I think the other one. Yes, yeah, the other one. So in one of those scopes over here, there is a uh, bring to the... God damn, get out of my way, get the honey. And talk to bring to the... My fat old sister favorite sport is belly barging. Okay, although she's Dean, she attended Fat Hanks High you won't believe that Brutilda's party trick 
is eating a bucket of beans. Oh boy. <sighs> well, let's go to the next one. So, behind the portal to Gobi's Valley, to go behind it, Grunchy's best friend at which school was the awful Saggy Maggie. When relaxing, she usually reads Big Butts and Guts magazine. Okay. While sipping a glass of her favorite smoochy elephant sweat. Yeah, I took a hit there uh, on the mummy, so I don't know much about that. <laughs> Next one. So, in front of the witch's head, on the area that we can go to Freezy's Peak, the, the disgusting Rantudas has telepose on toes for breakfast. Then, she usually has slug stew for dinner. Yank! And for lunch? What are bags? The Finest with eyeball ice cream for dessert. How horrid. I couldn't read that one, that great. Anyway, so. Let's go to the next. Well, you see, Grunty, I do Let's Plays. Part of, of doing a Let's Play is talking, so I had to talk. And no other choice, goddammit. Uh, this is kind of dark uh, on the screen, on the top screen, so I'd be using the, the thing over here. Alright. So. After going through that path over there, uh, that very awful path, we have a brain to the here close by the place you can get the uh, red feathers as a cheap coat. Revolting Gruntilda's bedroom has rotten fish hanging from the ceiling. Our decoration. She also has a lucky bush growing in the pot beside her path. Feel feel bag. And you'd be sick if you saw her enormous spotty purple undies. Don't, don't mention that again. Don't, don't, please don't. No, I, I don't want to mention my, my head. Except when she becomes the daughter one when she storm was doing Then you can tell me about that. I'm just kidding. I'm just uh, I don't like stairs much in my lair. The hours make me gasp. For air. Gee, I want the, the freaking mine. Anyway, uh, I'll be looking on the screen of my notebook because it's better. It's, it's really lighter than uh, the one at my my TV. The TV can get very dim. I don't know why. But, hey, didn't do much about that. Alright. Going this way. You know, one thing is, if I ever decide to let's play Banjo Kazooie again, I'll be I'll be doing that on uh, emulator because I can save state, and so if I did a commentary that I dislike, I just save save load the save state. Did you jump from here? I think you can. Anyway, well, I miss Rumbrin too. The, this cost me some stuff for the next episode, but there she is, right behind here. 
Did you know water bags keep a lucky fill hunky in her pocket for luck? I've also seen my sister cuddling her dirty undies in bed at night. She's really proud of her broomstick. It's a top of the range super good flyer, whatever. Anyway, bye bye. Oh, uh, there's a mumble talking over there. Oh, what? Why does it's like this? Not supposed to be like this. He has it never left. There's took some hits on the whip slash corridor over there. But here should be the last place where you're gonna find it. Last bring to the come. I'll take your bite. Oh wow. Well there's Bring to the to actually help me out on that one. God damn. So the path here is open. I opened it on the last episode. But Ah, well, there she is. <laughs> All right, this is the last brain tilt of the game, guys. Crossing Grinchilda's favorite pastime is flying radio controller bats. Ah, oh, this actually sounds kind of fun. This poor guy called Greasy Grum was her first and only boyfriend. Crazy guy, yeah, he did. Oh, when she was there in my room, used to have a mad vulture as a pen. Oh, yeah. oh poor, yeah, give me, give me my life back. Anyway, so, with that, this is it for the bonus episode, guy. So, if you're looking for a print to this, now I know where every single one of them are. I'm pretty sure of it. Anyway, thanks everyone for watching. Catch you guys next time. Where you face print this yourself. Why we need to know all the information about her? Are we stalking her? Are we fanboys? Turn on next time. A more painter and Kazooie. Bye bye. I don't know why I wink. You can see me winking. Anyway.